as a competitor, it's tough too when you get left home because you don't feel as much a part of the team, right? You grind with these guys every day and you want to be there to pat the guys on the back when they score touchdowns or make big plays on defense. And so it's hard when you're uh, staying home, but uh, the veteran guys, we all got together and we watched the games and we were cheering them on hard. So when they came back, we were really excited for them. It was such a great opportunity for the young guys uh, that Coach Moss let a, a lot of the veterans stay back because um, they got a lot of time and they got to show the ma upper management what uh, what they can do. So as a competitor, though, I would love to be out there, but I understand you got to evaluate everybody. Uh, and so when I get my opportunity in this uh, second preseason game, um, I'm just really excited to hit the field with all these guys. The one thing about my injury was um, it uh, wouldn't get any worse because it was torn, right? So uh, just pain management. Um, the, the hard thing was not being able to do what I wanted to do in practice. So a lot of times you would have to uh, slow things down in practice and not take as many reps. So then you would lose it just so you're healthy enough for the game. But uh, towards the end of the season when I got benched is when I finally got healthy because I finally took the time off. Uh, and then this off season, just rehabbing my, my wife is a wonderful physical therapist. So she did a great job with me. She's my secret weapon. Uh, she did a great job of getting me back. And this is the healthiest I've felt in a, in a long time. And it's the fastest. I did a lot of speed work in the off season um, and a lot of body maintenance stuff in the off season. And this is the best I've felt in years. I think he's just locked in. There's a laser type focus that I see in him. Um, and I think sometimes when you get football taken away from you uh, in a meaningful stretch of games uh, last year, I think you look look into the mirror a little bit and get excited about the next opportunity and i've talked about it i mean i don't think he he realized he'd get an, a, an opportunity this quickly to be a starting quarterback again and and he's taken advantage of it you can tell the way the offseason preparation the how in shape he is right now uh the best i've seen him look um you know throwing the ball to command he has but also i see him comfortable comfortable in this offense which he's been in for four years and then with the players, he's getting more and more comfortable every day because they're all new to him. When you get to a new team, especially in professional football, and I've said this before, it's it's not every day where you get a second chance, especially in professional sports. So I feel like I've gotten this second chance. I feel rejuvenated. I feel excited. I'm not taking anything for granted. I'm going to go out there and give everything I got uh, for my team, for my coaches, um, because they gave me a second chance, right? So I'm rejuvenated. I'm excited. Uh, and getting back to the fundamentals of having fun. Last year was difficult because when you're not winning games, it's not as fun. Fun, right and so a lot of things can be weighing down on the quarterback shoulders especially when you're not winning games so getting back to the basics when I was six years old why did I play this game because I loved it because it was fun and so I've had a lot of joy in this camp is getting to know these new guys building new relationships but I have found uh, myself smiling a lot more out here playing some football the quarterback we tell them there's a tremendous amount of responsibility on the quarterbacks each and every day um, not only to, to make the co coaches feel comfortable with the plan they put in but also the other players that look up to them for leadership when they're when they're the quarterbacks are on making good decisions and, and, and dispersing the ball, you know, um, the way they should, it makes everybody better. And uh, I think he's doing a great job of doing that.